playing overseas and I'm not playing in the NBA. And to be honest, um, it's really an amazing experience. And I think it's disrespectful for people to talk about the competition over here. Obviously, a lot of these guys haven't played in the NBA, but you have a lot of guys, professional players, who come from different areas of the world who play in this league or play in Taiwan, or play in the Philippines, or play in these many different countries. I think it's very disrespectful to disrespect all these guys just because they didn't make it to the NBA. NBA only has 450 slots. It's gonna be hard for everybody in the world to make it to the NBA. So it don't mean that they don't have talent. It don't mean that they can't play in the NBA. It don't mean that they're not good. It's just the NBA might not be for them. Playing basketball overseas, you know, so this is my first time ever doing this in the 18 years of being in the NBA. Um, I'm playing overseas and I'm not playing in the NBA. And to be honest, um, it's really an amazing experience. You know, really just get away, you know. And sometimes you gotta get away to get away. So, uh, this is great for me just to be here, um, be here in Taiwan with you know, these beautiful fans and the people here. It's just so amazing. Yeah, they bring me a lot of fruit and stuff like that. So I've been eating this. Like, I've never seen an orange like this, really. Yeah, this is an orange. So I've been uh, eating these. These are really, really good. So I love you. <laughs> and LA. And it's a real good experience. Just playing basketball here. Um, yeah, my coach doesn't speak English, so it was really crazy to be playing with a coach that don't really speak English and, you know, how you communicate with this guy. So when we have a translator, we got to talk to the translator. He got to translate what he's saying to the coach. And in my mind, I'd be like, is he really telling the coach what I'm saying? Um, but, but then, you know, I really like the coach. Man. He's a real, he's a real good guy. Real tiny, real tiny, his name is Bobo. And he's always smiling. And I think it's disrespectful for people to talk about the competition level here. Obviously, a lot of these guys haven't played in the NBA, but you have a lot of guys, professional players, who come from different areas of the world who play in this league or play in Taiwan or play in the Philippines or play in these many different countries. I think it's very disrespectful to disrespect all these guys just because they didn't make it to the NBA. The NBA only has 450 slots. It's gonna be hard for everybody in the world to make it to the NBA. So it don't mean that they don't have talent. It don't mean that they can't play in the NBA. It don't mean that they're not good. It's just the NBA might not be for them. Fire. Guava, okay. They fire, I don't even front. They got some really good fruit here. And noodles too. I got some fire noodles right here. So I like the spicy noodles, so I got these. Yeah.